What are you doing down here? Don't you know Agna Farhold is haunted by the spirits of the Arathi? So? Are you foolish or just stupid? Oh, I see. The Twisted Gnome has found herself a champion. How delightful. Nanny always was a fool. So immersed in her work that she failed to see the deception before her very eyes. The Red Legion has her formula, because I gave it to them. At this very moment, they are moving crates of it eastward towards the city of Rathir, where they will fetch a high price. Poor Nanny. So trusting, so pathetic. Of course she can never learn of my ruse, can she? I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 Oh.
This is too hard to believe. But you can accept the strangest fact that you were wrong. Yes, but that and this endless vacuity is horrible. The Ancient Ones were here. They delivered themselves into the world. The time-worn cycle turns with ages. The seasons drift along the stream. They wait for the past. The future brings the forming storm. This is no place for a home for anyone.
these walls are grown, are built of stone. Lovingly this place was crafted. You see the lights, the mystic halls of ordered reality? They are the faces of the missing, the embodied truth of the lost souls. There are so many of them. Still, you can see them. They are like pathetic charades. Some with good intentions, and you can't fault them that. But the majority of them are just a hoax. Needless to say, I don't like it here. You could have stayed free and lived a comfortable life, but you couldn't settle a disquiet that haunts people like you. a secret to tell you. I am not sad. When I was a girl, my father used to tell me that when you grow old with someone, you tie your fates together and create a pattern that is part yours and part theirs. My father said that this is why when an old person dies, their partner is never far behind. But I do not feel that way. I feel free.
May your hollow gods keep you, mortal. I am called Airy. Your face is new to me. You are different from those in Gorhart. They amuse me, and I strive to learn all I can from them. Have you come to ask about the Tuatha? I can offer only what I know, and hope it will suffice. Yes, I witnessed this crime, although I did not recognize the one who perpetrated it. It is often difficult to distinguish one mortal from another. The victim was Eluvia, but I knew her only by name. You must be hoping that I can offer advice, but I cannot. If she is meant for the Great Cycle, then so be it. However, I would be quite interested to find out whether one of my kind would benefit from one of your mortal remedies. I've always wondered. It will need to be powerful. Your delicate forms are far more sensitive than ours. In fact, it's astounding that you survive as long as you do. Farewell. to live for the rest of my life without him knowing. Well, then I'll deal with that. I think there's something to be said for it. I think it's noble. Yeah, I could tell someone, but that's just asking for praise. What makes it an act of kindness is that nobody knows, or at least that he doesn't know. I let him have the glory. No one has to know his arrow missed. He saved the town. He's a hero.
Enchanted Thrang in combat fair. Finian cycles kept. The exploits of this maiden's role, a burdensome and heavy toll. She lived among the mortal clans and bargained with their kind. Throughout the town they stood in fear of the brilliant fighter near. Everyone in Gorhart is talking about the attacks. They say that the Red Legion is receding back into the shadows from whence they came. It is all thanks to you. You found the formula and destroyed it. Now, you may think you understand the impact of this act, but you truly do not. You are a friend to this village and to me, Nanny Hanry. Take this. It is not much, but it gives you an idea of my gratitude. Farewell. Is it? You made it. Just in time, too. Give me the potion. It will help, but it's not enough. Someone must go to the Fae and explain what happened here. One small misunderstanding and we'll no longer just be strangers to the Fae. We'll be enemies. You're turning out to be very helpful, my friend. You have my gratitude. I'll see to it that you're honored. Rumor says that the House of Ballads has its headquarters not far from here, in Glendara to the northeast. Try to gain entrance if you can. Farewell. Stay close to the village.
Come in, rest your boots by the fire, and drown your worries in a flagon of our finer. Stick around. Fay in Gorhot. It isn't right. Yes. Are you here for a weapon? Going to earn a lord's faith? I'll be here. Hello there. Care to part with some gold? See me again. In the country of Nirilim's embrace, the summer manifests as an immortal fay. You know her, him, it, as the resplendent warrior or the ardent conqueror. You mortals named him King Issa. In the youth of your people's memory, you bore witness to Issa's exploits. He is your legend of might and eminence. Come, 
Listen to a tale of Issa and On. The gods. Ugh, finally. Someone that looks like they could stand up to a moderate breeze. There's need for an adventurer such as yourself. Me and a crew are mounting an expedition to a new land south of here. Ah, clever and strong, I see. It's as I said, we're going to the teeth of Naros, the land south of Dalentarth. If you want more information, seek Helic Cross. He's leading us. We're camped beyond Edmir. Glad that's done with. Keep walking. Speak with two legs. Please help me. Are the two legs are cruel? They will not help. No. I am cast. You believe me? Many think I am just another two legs. They are wrong. I am a wolf, cursed to wear this shape by evil sprites as some cruel game. I still have wolf thoughts in my head, but two leg bodies are so clumsy they can't even catch dumb meat birds. I must be changed back. The sprites are near. Even now I smell them, but I cannot fight in this form. Will you <laughs> help, Two Legs? Thank you, Two Legs, but the task will not be easy. I need water from a magic well, guarded by the sprites that cursed me. <laughs> be warned, the sprites have much magic, for the well they guard is older than this wood. And from that, they draw um, their power. The sprites guard the well, which is near the river to the north. <sighs> Beware them. They have much magic. Return oh. swiftly.
any two legs do you come to me empty-handed what is the meaning of this the well holds powerful magic as old as these trees our elders told us its true name your two-leg kind might <laughs> call it the well that wanders Throughout the forest, it would vanish and reappear, like a wolf on hunt. But what prey it seeks. Hmm. Before I was cursed, I remember... <laughs> strongly atop the water was the scent of leechwood. Perhaps the well seeks that. Leechwood? That is the two-leg name for that wood that feasts on strength. It appears through the... <laughs> forest. Should not be hard to find. The scent of the well was strong with its odor. It must be what the well is seeking. It is there, two legs. The scent of water. Faint, but it does not escape me. My pack <laughs> shall hear of your compassion and <laughs> honor. I now go to the wilds and rejoin my pack. <sighs> and now you may continue on your path, but with the knowledge of how to fight <laughs> with the strength of a wolf. Now I shall drink deep of this potion and return to my kind. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Welcome in. My shop anytime. Farewell. Need supplies. Nice to see you. Beware. The Red Legion is about. I don't know if I'll ever... Take on another prepare well. What do you need? I'll be here. Welcome. <laughs> Care to part with some gold? Come see me again. I'm happy to help you with what I've... you need, I'm open to buy or sell. Need something? <laughs> Pull up a stool, stranger. But I <laughs> nice to see you.
Proceed no farther, mortal. You are not one of our kind, and the seat of Sir Sagral will never be occupied by one so mundane. Hallam the White prepares the contest, and he must not be interrupted at this, our time of greatest need. No doubt you speak of Illuvia, impetuous fool. I told her to avoid your settlement, to avoid Odoroth altogether. She never listened to my warnings. I will chastise her appropriately upon her return. It is a loss, yes. But not the first unexpected event in this telling. What happened? Yes, I have noticed a growing number of humans in Dalintarth. It must be this war. I can't say I understand it. Oh, yes, your kind usually expects some form of trophy for good deeds. A bauble? A prize? Perhaps another time. If you would be so kind as to deliver this message. We mean the people of Gorhart no ill will. They have nothing to fear from us. Farewell. Listen, all of you. As you've clearly heard, a rare vacancy has occurred. Ageless one. I am Arvia. Until we meet again. 